and more proof that this is impacting everyone. Nationally, the number of new unemployment cases jumped by 3 million, the highest number dating back more than 50 years. My co-anchor Nick Lefebvre is at home working today. He spoke to an expert about these numbers, Nick. Hi, Juliet. Yeah, I got a chance to speak with Gene Sperling. He was a director of the National Economic Council for both presidents, Clinton and Obama. He said of those numbers, they're jarring, just as anyone would expect. I asked him as well about the stimulus bill. He says it is needed. He does believe it is going to do some good. He also points out we can get through this. What would you be telling one of the two presidents that you advised right now if you were going through this? I would be telling them that the hard part is that this is going to be uh, about execution and getting things out fast and doing it well. And that, you know, sometimes in normal policy, sometimes at the White House, you pass, you design the policy, you propose it, you pass the legislation, and then you move on. There are other times where the execution is everything. What we're seeing now is that there's been a complete failure of execution on the health crisis part, and it's, it's going to cost us lives, and it's going to cost us months of economic recession. You'd have to say no more. The focus on making sure these small business loans actually get out, the focus on making these unemployment checks get out has got to be a number one priority because everybody who's hearing this good news from me is not going to feel it's good news if six weeks from now they're mired in red tape, uh, uh, worried about losing, you know, a lot of their economic life and can't get the check. Now, I spoke to Mr. Sperling for a good 10, 15 minutes. If you want to see the entirety of the interview, we're going to have it on our website later on this evening.